Bang! Hold on now. I love mm. me a good twist out. Hold on now. Who's that they can't go outside with no twist? everyone hello 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 it's been about anyways today's video as you can tell by the title will be a natural hair length check straightener whatever I've been natural for about since I was 16 17 21 so about five to four to five years I don't have the exact pin date I don't know the exact day I started and all that stuff but it has been over four years but less than five you get what i'm saying so i figured today would be the perfect time to um straighten my hair and hopefully it comes out good i've never straightened it before so if the end results are hideous then please bear with me <laughs> if you see you will see my hair flaking bear with me because i have seboroid not sure how you pronounce it but i have seboroid dermatitis so yes, my scalp gets very flaky. I could wash it in the morning and that same night it'll be flaking a bit. Like, it's bound to happen. I washed my hair two days ago, so I figured let me just record this video before I do something to it, which I never do. I always wear scarves, so all good. Anyways, anyways, I'm rambling. So I figured let's just get started. I'll start off by, I'll begin by blow drying. As you can see, I don't have the comb, which kind of sucks. But I'll begin by blow drying my hair. As you can see, I'm gonna straighten it. Can't remember last time I comb my hair. <laughs> Finger detangle. Um, I'm gonna straighten it as much as I much as I can using the you know stretch method. I think it's called. I don't know. I'm not as deep into the natural hair community as I used to be because some of y'all natural Nazis be crazy. But <laughs> but yeah, as you can see, this is. This will be my first section. I don't think I'm gonna straighten it all right now. I'm uh, I should have done this on already stretched hair. Now the video is gonna be very extensive for no reason. Oh, gosh. Ah, that's annoying. that's enough for this section so that looks kind of straight enough for me so I'll just take it and I'll take this section as you can see me doing and twist it up for straightening after I do the whole head
you can tell by my face on this section I put the blow dryer on hot and <laughs> it got the job done a whole lot quicker let's just say that go through with the comb yes I know I need to cut my ends I don't think I've ever gotten my hair professionally trimmed honestly no there's no thinking to it I've never I've never been to the salon because of I've been to the salon a couple of times when I was in middle school because my mom didn't feel like doing my hair but I tend not to go because of my scalp condition so yes I am type embarrassed about it so I don't need like someone you know eesh, like ripped good hair out I don't know if you can see that damn need to be more careful but um Yes, I'm, ash I'm not ashamed. This is this is the best it's been, quote unquote best, quote the best it's been in a long time. I guess my my head and shoulders is getting through to it, so that's good. Yes, I've been to a dermatologist just to ch get charged like a hundred dollars just for her to poke my scalp and tell me what I already know. Gave me some little ass shampoo like this small that barely did anything. So head and shoulders works for me with the almond oil in it. You see like this one is straighter because I had this one on hot and this one was on warm. So I'm gonna just go back with the blow dryer. Lightly. I don't who like whose idea was it to sit here in a full face of makeup and a damn sweater and use a blow dryer? <laughs> Who did I think I was? see why I, I tend to keep my hair in scarves or twisted up like beanie man or whatever the case may be because I don't like this hey I can't I hardly can wear crochet or I don't wear tracks like that because my scalp I have to wash my hair every week and for me to get a style where I can't get to my scalp it's impossible so I tend to wear either wigs or just wear my real hair hardly out honestly wear my real hair in his car. Some braiding. But yeah. It's just a hassle and a half. As you can see, yes, very clearly I have 4C. I don't have that 4A where I could throw some water and gel and call it a day. Like, nah, that's it's not the case here, Fab. You gotta work for it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Wanna say hi? Mm -hmm. Hi. You have to scratch, poke your head. Huh? You have to poke your head. Poke my head. <laughs> say hi. Hi. <laughs> it's the last one. All right. We're finally done. Oh, with the <laughs> with the. 
slow as then have the straightener on this whole time but we're finally done with the drying portion aka just pretty much heating it up well stretching it out i guess you could say without so that i won't have the so, i'm sorry i'm on my phone on macari if you can you can see because i ain't got no self-control but um focus on me now um yeah we're done with the blow drying section so we're about to go on to the the straightening section obviously so i'ma just put my phone down but anyways i have to wait for the to heat up i think i don't have a straightener this is my sister's straightener she'll let me use it god bless her soul but god don't bless her soul if i get heat damage <laughs> but porcelain ceramic can you see that? Well, you ain't gotta see it because I already told you. I told you what it is. So, yeah. Now I'm just I have it set to um, 4:15. The one right before is 3:45, so I'm gonna just leave it at 4:15. It can go higher, but actually, it's right before 4:15. It doesn't say a number, but it's beautiful. Yeah. Go to the bathroom. Let's get started. Uh, I got a scrunchie, you know. I don't know exactly how this whole straightening thing works, but I think it's better to start from the back. And I'll have everything else tied up. Like, I don't even have a comb. I have a comb, obviously. You saw me using the comb. But do I have, like, I wanted to get one of those thin-ass combs, you know. But... My sister gave me the option. I turned it down. She threw them out. And now I need a comb. <laughs> you should have took what was offered to you, fam. Yep, push it all the way. Good job. Let's go. I have absolutely no idea what I'm doing. You're, you're just doing your hair. Your makeup I started the process already, so therefore I will finish it. What is it? Is it hot? It's very hot. Okay, well, but it's not that hot. So I should put it up higher because I feel like. Like what? I want to. Okay. I'll put it up a bit because. That's my little bump at the end. You saw that? You know when the hairstylist at the salon be like, "I'm just mm -hmm. give you a, give you a little bump." Gosh, this is coming up uglier than I assumed. I don't know I don't know I feel like I'm doing such a horrible job I don't even think like I should be guiding y'all on what to do don't you see like it's smoking don't look to me for a guy for this like why not I have no idea what I'm doing and it's look better in my head I am not liking this one bit I really want to know 
whose idea was it for me to do this video but i don't care how crappy looks at the end i'm gonna upload this simply because i did my whole face for this video i'm uploading this video y'all gonna see this video But then now y'all even want to see me. Y'all gonna see this. <laughs> the funniest part is that I'm like sitting here risking heat damage. Ah! This whack ass hairstyle. Like. Thank you. Bye. Why am I doing this to myself? <laughs> I have to put that little backwards bump in there. It's like in the camera. In the camera it looks trash, but like when I'm looking in the mirror over there, it looks nice. But right here, I don't. I think it's this that's throwing me off right here. Okay. That's a little better. <laughs> okay, as you can tell, I did a bit of the portion off camera because I'm just like, the amount of memory I'm using is to record this video is ridiculous. Maybe because I'm moving like, ooh. Maybe because I'm moving at a snail's pace, that might have something to do with it also, but... Uh, honestly, I'm like already over this look. I don't like it, but... <laughs> Straightening this shit is not for me. I'm too scared. <sighs> That's it. That's all I was going to do. Like, I'm curling it like I'm a fucking 15 year old church girl. Honestly, even though she doesn't have 4C hair, I recently watched um, Arnell, you know, Alyssa Ashley's sister, Arnell Armin, I wanna say her name is. I, I'm actually subscribed to her. But I don't know, I recently just, even though it's old, I recently watched her hair straightening video. And I was just like, let me go straighten my tresses real quick. I'm like horrible at this whole. Thing. Okay. Woo, look at these edges. Oh, shit. But as you can see, this is already like puffing up but I'm not going over it again because I already went over it like 13 times so I just gotta finish this little section and we out here like this ain't happening for another five years so yeah better enjoy this while <laughs> like why am I still bothering at this point honestly because I like to I don't 
I have a habit of giving up, so I promised myself <laughs> I would finish this to the end. So that's what I'm gonna do, even though it looks like trash. And you know, the three people who watch this video might end up roasting me, but I'm doing best. Oh, perfect. My battery's about to die, but it's okay because I'm prepared. I purchased the other uh, spare battery and it's already charged. Look at this. This is. Flip it the other way when that first way doesn't. Oh my goodness. Okay. I'm like looking like the struggle right now. If you were able to tell, which I'm pretty sure you were. Look at this. My battery just died, so I just switched it out. But look, this is the only section, and then we're we can get the hell out of here. <laughs> because honestly, ain't nobody gonna want to follow, follow this tutorial. It's a little crazy. Like, <laughs> it's kind of puffy. I look like, I look like James Brown or something. Ooh, okay, I thought I was done. No, the last session, right? So tomorrow's the. I doubt I'll have this up by tomorrow, but oh, well, I'll have that. I'll have it up by today, the fifteenth. But tomorrow's the sixteenth, I believe. Black Panther comes out. Like Panther, I said Bantha. And I'm pretty excited for that. What I don't, what I don't like though, is that the tickets are in 3D, and I wear glasses, so like it's a hassle. If I'm not, if I don't wear my glasses, then the movie's like in 5D for me, cause my eyes are already fucked up. But if I do wear the glasses. I can't really see because obviously I can wear the glasses but some you know some 3d glasses they are changing now it doesn't fit over my glasses you know like my prescription glasses so hopefully that's not an issue I really I truly truly don't care for 3d movies but I didn't purchase the tickets so I will not be an ungrateful. I'm like, I feel like I'm whispering. I'm sorry if y'all can't hear me, but at the same time, nothing of importance is being said. Okay. And we are. <laughs> I look like. Look like James Brown. Okay, how about this? Does this look better? Hold on now, fam. Don't hurt him now. <laughs> Don't. So as you can see, how it was initially. But you live <laughs> and you learn. Okay. I'm sitting here trying to get this fucking, I mean, sorry, I'm trying to get this, look at this, all these dead ends that need to be cut. This side looks better, obviously, because I just recently freshly did it, but this side, as you can tell, it's like, it's been chilling for a while. This side of back look, hopefully it's focused because I can't see what I'm doing, but I really look like, it's not even like a cue straight, I look like those moms, and oh my gosh. I like those moms in the 80s that got their hair straightened for the first time. Well, they're moms now, but in the 80s, you know, the 80s were their prime. That's what I look like right there. Come on, honey, we gotta go. The Walkman. We gotta go get the Walkman. It just came. <laughs> okay, hold on. I think it's like, it might be these earrings because I am not liking this. Okay. Let's be a bit more dramatic. That might help my cause. 
Okay. This. Ooh. I want to pick my roots, but I ain't got to pick. I'm not gelling my edges. I'm not doing none of that. Because I already put all this heat on it. So we going. We going. Okay. So I just wanted to. Obviously, it doesn't look the best. And I'm really scared because I don't want to say I'm going to get heat damage. But. I did more than one pass. Let's just be real honest. And um, I'm just hoping. Well, I'm just hoping I don't get heat damage. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, if you did. Sorry, my lips are like. It might be winter, but my lips have been peeling like crazy lately. But anyways, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I know none of you will be taking my tips because let's be real, I did not have anything useful to give me out because I, I'm pretty sure I did a trash job. But at the same time, it's like, it's not bone straight, but I don't know. Let's be real, I'm 4C. It's going to take a lot to get bone straight hair on me, especially at home with a, you know, with my own little straightener and my own hair dryer. So I just did the best I could. So I'm going to wear it like, you know. I'm going to wear it like a proud mom for, I want to like, bag up. I'm sorry, I'm not even looking at the camera, I'm looking at the viewfinder, but I want to straighten this part a bit more because these ends are really, really bothering me. Like, look, it's like one huge lump of just fur, but I won't. This I look good. <laughs> Hold on, I'm gonna just I'm gonna stop it. I'm gonna take a photo like that. But I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you guys did, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Um, if your comment is gonna be along the lines of "You're gonna get heat damage," "You're gonna get heat damage," I know. And I will probably not even make a video reverting my hair back. Cause simply, I don't have the time. I'm in school full time. Like that. That's why it's been three weeks since I recorded. School started and things got real, real. So. <laughs> This is anatomy class. No, but anyways, um, this video is already long enough, so I'm just hoping you guys enjoyed this. I won't even call, uh, it's not a tutorial. It's just me sitting in front of the camera, straightening my 4C hair. That's it. I'm not saying follow these tips. I'm not saying I'm not going to get heat damage. I'm not saying this is the way to do it. All I'm saying is the last time I straightened my hair out, it was about four to five years ago and I was like mm, let's see where I am in my natural hair journey and now all I do is I twist my hair up in those dookie braids that you saw in the beginning and I wear scarves that's it or wigs wigs are a girl's best friend I don't be getting them lace fronts and all that stuff but you gotta do what you gotta do hair still more than suffice anyways don't like I'm trying to find a cute Look at this shoulder length. Okay, it's looking good in the mo in the monitor in the viewfinder. But I'm very I'm sure when I upload it, I'm gonna look crazy. My makeup is gonna be splotchy. Nothing's gonna be blended. My eyebrows gonna be uneven. My eyeshadow is trash. But as I said already, not a makeup artist. Let's get that straight. Anyways. Like I said for the 14th time, I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you all in my next video and hopefully it doesn't take me three weeks to upload the next one. Bye. Love ya.